Hey guys, Master Mark Menard here today, and I'm going to be going through some basic bow staff techniques uh, on multiple videos. This first video we're going to be working on is our forward strike. Now, I have a lot of people in my organization that is interested in learning the bow staff, and if you're good at patterns, if you're good at forms, if you're good at hongs, or pumseis, or katas, or whatever you call them out there, you could be very good at the bow staff as well because a lot of the movements that are inside the bow staff techniques are similar motions that you do in your regular forms. So the first one we're going to be working on is our forward strike. And I want to talk about forward strike. Forward strike, is the, the end of the bow is going to hit you right in the top of the head if you throw the attack straight out. So that technique is even to right at the crown of your head. The other thing you want to know about the bow staff is you want to make sure you hold it in three even sections. So this side is even, and the middle and then the end are all about the same distance in length. And that's very, very important. When I grab the bow staff, I'm holding my right hand with an undergrip, like I'm curling a weight, and my left hand is like I'm riding a motorcycle, like I got, I'm doing my clutch or something like that. So that's how you're gonna be holding the bow staff. The first motion, you're going to bring your right hand up to your ear, like you're throwing a javel, and the left hand is straight out and grabs the bow. And again, you gotta make sure that you got three even sections. Next, you're gonna step forward in a front stance, a strong front stance, and the left hand is going to come to your belt, and the other hand, your right hand, which is by your ear, goes right to your solar plex. And you can probably see in the video how the top of the bow is pretty even to the top of my skull. Okay, so let me show you guys again. Hold it up, right hand, to the right ear, you can see that, it's right there. Left hand is straight out, I step forward in my front stance, I keep this bow staff parallel to the floor, and then I bring my hand to my hip, and I bring this hand straight out. Now one of the things you wanna do is when you throw your strike, you gotta twist that hand over the top. Okay, if I hold the bow like this and I hit something, what'll happen is my hand will fly out. And that's not a good thing, you don't want your hand flying out when you're striking something because in our program, we do sparring with the bow and everything. We do one steps with the bow, we do our forms with the bow. So we do a lot of different things with the bow staff. And if you hit something and you have resistance, that hand's gonna pop right out and you don't want that to happen. So twist it over at the very end. So let's do it again. I start with my feet together on the marching drill. The bow is parallel to the floor, I step. And then the hands come here to here, just like that. And then when I do my step, I have the student step forward again, and we step forward with the right hand coming down just like that. Okay, so what do I do to create speed with the bow staff? One of the things I do is I don't use the bow when I do my, my drilling. What I'll do is I'll pretend I have a bow in my hand, and then what I do is I put the hand straight here, and this comes out at the same time. I'm not using my bow staff at all. I'm actually doing it without the bow. And that motion will help me with the speed of my technique. And drilling the bow like that is very, very important when we're working, especially on forward strike. So I'm here, I step, down, just like that. Okay, watch again here. Okay, also from the sideways view, parallel, step out, and twist over right at the end. So that technique is forward strike, it's in your patterns. Every single pattern you do with the bow pretty much has forward strike in it. It's like throwing punches in your regular uh, forms or pumseis that you practice in class. And that's what I wanted you to learn today about the forward strike, okay? And uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.